clip in. Okay, come on. I was thinking to keep them, you know, on there. She said, you're on your way to start them. You did? How did it go? Girl, what you got me from that? Turn around. You got to turn around in the chair, right? Oh. Yeah, I'm going to slide you up. Bro. Well, on the stand, I was thinking, just, you don't make like a little small, not like a braid going across or something when you're laying in there. Hey, Dana Money. <laughs> okay, you're going to have to read. Push it up just a little bit. Somebody say ho. <laughs> she called us a ho. No, she's trying to say hi. <laughs> I, I know. know Dana would not do that. Mama, you she's keep hitting me in the head with you? your boob. Okay. I'm good, Dana. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, we know. It's a, I know. <laughs> Y'all, look. I be typing and I look and all the wrong words be up there. Hold on, y'all. My tank top on back. He said to me, AMW Sister Foundation, he gave me a sign. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So. You gonna try to find a dude? Okay. A suit is a cheaper alternative. Hold on, let me lean back. They say I can't read it without my leg. That's an Alicia. Hey, sugar. So, I'm not, since my hair is short, I'm not going all the way down. I'm going to start like right above the ear. And this is some hair that I was sent from a company to try it and then give a review on it. And so, how you doing? Yo, I thought about doing it on myself. I'm good. I'm good. I ain't gonna complain. I haven't had much energy, y'all. I really just woke up. I woke up long enough this morning to do a few things, and I went right back to sleep. So, 2008, Clarence, what's good? So, this is the hair that I was sent by Bala Bella Hair. I don't know if y'all can read that. It's 20 inches, and it's clip-ins. Okay, and this is it. When I say I'm doing two things at once, I'm doing two things at once. Okay, so yes, it's human hair, as far as I know, because they could put boo boo on a box and say that it's something, it's something else, but you know how that goes. So, this is the hair that I was sent. It is 20 inches long, and it's jet black, and a one, and it is clip-in, and I'm getting ready to open it. So that you see the physics. No, no, I got it. So, let's see how many pieces we get. So, we're going to start with... Hold up. Here, I guess these are the two longest pieces. Now, even with the way that I took it out, it doesn't tangle much. I mean, it, it did, but it didn't get naked. You know, sometimes you can get stuff that'll tangle, and it will tangle real bad to where you got to get a comb. And this is what it looks like. And these are the two longest tracks. I'm all in her face. <laughs> and it has three clips. Or is it four? One, two, three, four clips. It has four clips. Okay. And so we're going to start with these two pieces. Now what I'm going to do is, um, because her hair is so short and she want to make sure that it stay in, um, 
I'm just going to start braiding. I'm not going to really make a, a really straight part. I'm just going to start braiding and gather some hair as I go. She hate that part. I just hate the edges. I'm not going to even start with the edges. Ooh, yes, girl. We just let them edges down. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to start braiding. It's not going to be a big braid. This is just a quick one. Yeah, your hair short, Stella. No, I'm <laughs> my um, lower back hurt. Right? Is that my stomach or yours? My stomach growling. Y'all might hear say, hey, feed me, see more. I'm not hungry. I got a buzz, I believe. The one that over mm -hmm. your head. Because, or what it is, see, that one your stomach tell you hungry. That's your stomach bubbling because, you know, you got the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> she said, I got the stuff. Miss Yosho, hey Yolanda, boo. That's my girl, Yolanda. Yolanda. Okay, so I just got a little piece of braid. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's just a little piece of braid. It's not straight. And I'm not parting anything. If you guys don't know Ms. Yosho from YouTube, um, her name also is Y.R. Collins. She is a Hello Kitty lover. And when I say lover, I mean she has a stash that won't wait, okay? I mean like OMG. <sighs> Y'all, I'm telling you, she um, does sign language. She is an advocate for um, cancer, breast cancer. No, I'm not putting in a beehive. I'm just making um, two braids that's going to meet up in the middle on each row. I'm going to do it in between. So, um, just two, it's just two anchor braids. It could be one long braid, but I don't want the end of braid to come onto the side. So, I'm putting one this way and one that way. And they'll meet right here in the middle. I'm not putting any rubber bands or anything. And I'm only doing this because her hair around the sides is short. And um want to give it something to hold on to. Now, clip-ins, you don't, it's supposed to be easy. Take a few minutes, um, which is true. I'm just going to do this one. And the rest of them I'll do the regular way because I want to show those of you that have never used clip-ins how easy it is. So, I got my two braids. And now you just take it, open the clip, okay, and you just slide them in. And they snap, you'll hear them close. What I'm going to do is alternate the track. So this one, this first one, I started it closer to the front right here. And it ended right behind the ear on this side. So when I make my next part, okay, that was the clips closing. So I make my next part. I will start from this side. Like that. It doesn't, your part don't have to be straight. This is something if you have a, you know, if you're relaxed or if you're natural and your hair is pressed out and you want a quick style. It might be taking me a little longer because her hair is short, and I know she's got to wear this to work, and she's going to be working where she's going to be moving at somewhat of a fast pace, um, and we want to make sure that they don't come out, okay? The clips are really sturdy. 
once they're in, they in, they do shift, okay, like in the same because it's not permanent. But if you don't have somebody just really yanking on and pulling on your hair, you shouldn't have to worry about it. We're the one we took loose. So here we go again. Unsnap the clap. That's <laughs> one, two, three. Yes, I just slide this part right here down under the braid. You don't have to do a braid. I could just clip this in my hair. You could just part your hair like I'm finna do right now. I'm not gonna braid that. I'm just gonna slide it in. So turn this way. So I'm gonna show you where I'm gonna start. Closer to this side, but mainly just slide it in. Yeah. Yep. Push sometimes. Ah. These things don't. Hold on, child. Clip. Hold that one. Okay. So there we go on this side. Okay, come on. Yeah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. It may not look like it's in order right now, but when I get through, come on. Let's see how many more we have. Okay, so that was two. Here is two more. Now instead of four clips, yes, it is. This one only has three. Okay. So we have two of these. Hold up. Now what I could do is start just a little above this part. On this side. Making sure that you get all of your areas pretty much covered. Yeah, hold that. <laughs> These are some sturdy clips. You gotta really push to close them. Yeah, so that's in there, okay? And it, I don't know if you can see that it is actually laying flat, okay? It's in there. I'm going to start from this side. And meet in the back with this one. It does look like that, but it's actually clipping, and you don't have any chemicals on your hair, and you don't have to worry about the stress of, um, you know, sometimes when you get a sew in, it's a lot of, even though your hair is braided, that's stress on your hair as well. And then when they sew it in, that's even more stress. But some people sew it in so tight that you feel like you're, you know, <laughs> yes. She already thinks she's cute as ever anyway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she is um so much like me the me now when I was her when I was younger I wasn't into makeup and hair and I would pull my hair in a ponytail I would get me a weave ponytail and I would be good with that you know what I mean and that's just it so she changes her hair just like I used to I don't change my hair that much anymore but I used to really, I mean, every day. Yeah, I used to hey, change my what? hair every day. Um, before I cut, before I went natural, I had a different hairstyle every day. And I would do it myself.
It said, hey, Corey. Hey. Look in the camera. Hey, Corey. Hey. I see you, we boy. Have, what? We have two small pieces that are going to be that size. And we have, well, we have four small pieces. So here's two. There's one, and there's two. So we have four small pieces. And then we have two more pieces this size. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is, since I'm getting closer to the top, some of that mousse right there. Miss, mm -hmm. I'm going to add a little bit of mousse. Just a little bit, but I'm only adding it to her hair like that. Can I want to like chicken doves? <laughs> I don't know where she get chicken doves from because you won't be able to see her hair underneath, you know, at the bottom, but at the top, I want it to lay as flat as possible. Okay, so I'm gonna just take my comb. We'll tame the edges in just a moment. That's just to lay it down just a little bit. If I don't respond back, it's because I miss your comment, okay? I'm not overlooking anybody, so put a part in the middle. That's what you're doing. That's what you want? Yeah. Why? What you're gonna do? I don't know. Just put them all in. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go up just a little bit more there. Yes, her hair is relaxed. It is. I ain't natural. But when my sister had to go back, but I'm gonna go natural, natural, natural. Hold that. She got my mouth put about it. Remember that song? The holiday goes like. Thug Holiday by uh, Trick Daddy. Girl, I ain't look. Trick Daddy? Yeah, it was on the radio. Mm. A long time ago, years yeah. back, like 2001. I don't so. know. It used to come on the radio. The time. only trick that I know was old Dirty Nasty Trick Daddy. Yeah, Trick Daddy. I know, but I ain't never heard the song Thug Holiday. This is for my hidden in the ghetto. It's all around. All of my thugs in the ghetto. Mm -hmm. Trick Daddy and Latasha Scott. Yeah, please, you know what I'm talking about. Don't get the chocolate started. The chocolate <laughs> know everybody. She bad as your daddy. She know everybody on the radio. <laughs> what year it came out? She had us going last night. I was in here in the closet playing music because of her. All right, chocolate. Yeah. That's Miss Chocolate. You know what I need you to do, though? Put that tablet down. Oh, uh, hindering mine. Oh. I 
got people taking my phone. <laughs> you know, you know. Hold it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Erica Badu, huh? <laughs> mm-hmm. Erica Badu and Anita Baker are my two favorites. Just so y'all know. No, scratch that. I lied. Erica Badu, Anita Baker, and Rihanna are my favorites. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I used to wonder about my child sometimes, y'all. When I tell you, let me tell you something. Told my daddy swear I was gay because I like Rihanna so much. First, I'm gonna tell you why I like Rihanna. For one. She has, um, for one, she can dress. I love the way she dresses. She's not afraid to take risks. And then I love her music. And I like her attitude as a person. Like, she would be giving, but then she would be like, you know, F some mm, mm, haters and stuff like that. You know, but she swore I was gay. I, I ain't got time. I ain't swear. I was like, baby, you all right? <laughs> no. What? You thought I was gay. Yeah, I, I was like, baby, that. you all right? Because, um. She had us an icon picture, and I was like, Mo, a lot of people do that. They have singles all over stuff. her page. Child, I was like, mm. a lot of people do that. Lord, are we like, getting ready to cross this threshold? Oh. Woo! You had me scared for a minute, girl. Even if I was attracted to what we're talking about, but I'm saying, even if I was, I like, I like guys too much. Anyway, so. <laughs> That ain't gonna change. That ain't gonna change. You just like your dad. Your daddy love women. He love women. That ain't like every part of a woman. Like, I know, right? He true. He true. Yeah. <laughs> everything got to be on point with it. If anything out of place, he. No, you see me feed me. And he be boisterous about it too. He just and I'm he like, real blind. You can't care. say that. People like man. You know, he that's how he and I'm like, you can't say that. What you like, everybody might not like. He, I'm, no, bump that. Mm-mm. But, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, is that you? No. Oh, I was about to say, I thought you said so. My daughter had a friend, y'all, come to our house to uh Corey birthday party. Oh, let me see. Let me see. Matter of fact, let me see who it was. Ah. Uh-uh. Oh. You can't say the person's name on here. Oh, you know how to tell people, say people's names? No, you won't put somebody on blast like that. They don't know him. Who like, am I? Uh, yeah, apparently don't know about it. Y'all don't know him. He he was my um he was my first great boyfriend, my very first boyfriend, and we found each other on Facebook like years ago. Like I think when I was still in high school, like junior year, and like ever since then we just be like you know talking back and forth. You know, hey, how you doing? Hey, I'm good. Mm-mm-mm-mm. And so we exchanged numbers like a couple of years back. You know, however long I had this phone number. And, um, he was like, he emerged to see me. So he was like, well, I'm, I'm coming in to Jack's today, you know, cause he from here, whatever, but he lives in Georgia with his dad. Cause, you know, he, he work on the boat and stuff. But, um, yeah, and I was like, oh, well, I ain't seen you, you know, in years. I was like, okay, so I'm gonna ask my people, can you come by? Um, I said, give me some time cause I gotta wait today, um, in a good mood to ask him. I don't, don't, don't act like you never did it before. What? So you never wait to ask Nana, can you go somewhere? Um, you waited until she was in a good mood to ask me. Nana? No. Well, what they saying? I can't see. I missed that. What they saying? They talking to each other. Oh. But anyway, yeah. But he, he still looked the same. Look the exact same. And he was like, um, he's like, man, it's crazy because I ain't seen you since, um, second grade. I said, no, actually, it was first grade. I said, because we had Miss DuBoss together, and I think that was first grade. I remember that lady, Miss mm-hmm. DuBoss. Big white lady. I used to love her. She was real nice. And, um, we had Miss, ooh, I couldn't stand Miss Lee. We couldn't stand Miss Lee. She was just so. The black rude. lady. Yeah, she was just rude me for no reason. And she was a spit when she thought. You know, we had her. <laughs> And he used to always get in trouble for like, well, we always used to get in trouble because he used to talk too much. I didn't talk all sexually. I could have. Oh. I could have though. What's tea? What's the mushy? The mushy. Okay. Oh. 
Since we don't talk about the stuff, we talk about this. This is it. Lord, you're laying this out. Yes. For the little more sit up. On the it's air. Called a to control flyways. This is not a, you know, the kind of moves that's like a fern hole. This is just a body. I need a brush. Look right down and get me a brush. Thank you. It's just that easy. It won't take you as long as it did me. Um, because I have to make sure that, you know, with her hair, that it stays in place. Now, when it's dry, you next. All right. <laughs> See, y'all have to catch me on them days when I'm in the mood to do hair because I'll be doing hair all day. But then when I'm tired, I'm tired. That's it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay. I'm, it's, it's the one thing about natural hair, you got to make sure you get some hair that's close to that natural texture. Which would be like a yanky. A yanky. That way, when you blow dry or flat iron, you'll leave out. You don't have to worry about it not looking like it's your hair. So, there we go. This is it. This is the finished product of the clip in. Oh, clip in. And it looks natural. It's not really bulky. You can. You know, of course you can feel the tracks if you put your hand on somebody's head, depending on how thick their hair is. She said you're doing good, but look, she's taking pictures. <laughs> yeah. But she said I'm doing good. Mm -hmm. Oh, doing good what? Oh, she asked me, am I, am I doing, oh, yeah. So, this is the hair. That I have installed with the clip ins. Um, you have two long pieces, two middle pieces, and, um, well, two four clip pieces, two of the three clip pieces, two of the two clip, and then you have four pieces of the one clip pieces that can go in the top. Um, so where you put, where you place your clips is on you. Um, just know that it's very easy. You don't have to braid your hair. You just clip them in. You part it, clip them in, and you brush it in place, comb it in place, and you go. So let's turn to the side. Give a side view. All right. There we go. So it's your girl, Risa Ree, and I thank you guys for watching. Y'all have a good one. Press stop. You sure? Oh, how you, how you do that? I got it. I got it. Wait, I did it. This is the most. Okay, you can go out there and take pictures. Okay.